Hi guys, welcome to this video about what you can do when you have this camera. I'm sorry, it's a little bit dark, but it doesn't matter, I think. When you have such a camera, it's a 360i camera, it's a little bit old. It looks a little bit uh, ugly. I have taped, I had taped it um, to, yeah, to protect against the lights the night lights infrared or yeah so i had it protected so it's not mirroring uh i but i had have removed it now um yeah so anyway it's a 360i or i360 camera and yeah it has some difficulties some some people have problems connecting to the wi-fi uh, I've made a lot of videos about that. If you have, are having problems connecting to the Wi-Fi, just watch these videos because it's actually not too difficult. So now I've fa been facing another problem uh, when I uh, connect it with the USB power. There's a new problem. So sorry for the bad camera quality. So I've now plugged it in. You can see the light inside and it should power on okay i hope you heard that it said uh system uh, i couldn't he hear uh, i couldn't understand fully but it said something like system restarting And then it said something, but it broke off. But sometimes it doesn't even say this, but instead, yeah, exactly, it says this. It continues saying this. It doesn't say, uh, I mean, after uh, system restarting, it should say connecting to Wi-Fi, and then you have the possibility to press the button and access the access point. But sometimes, yeah, so this time it almost reached system uh, startup completed, but it didn't because at the same moment it tries to, uh, go, to go around and then it goes back to system uh, restarting. Sometimes it just keeps saying system restarting, system restarting and so on every like 30 seconds or something like that. And the problem is caused by not having enough power here. So let's say in my uh, situation, I'm just getting power from this USB hub and that's not enough. And my alternate solution was this cheap USB uh, power supply that's good to charge maybe a phone uh, overnight but it's definitely not enough to power such a camera which uses a lot of power so if you want to solve this problem you have to use a stronger uh, power supply that's the only way you solved it and it, 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 it can solve it and it's very easy so yeah just use a stronger power supply plug it in and it will fully boot up automatically so i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time